Good morning, Emerson. It's a great day to be an Eagle. Today is Friday, September 17th, 1787. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did, did you say it's this this year is a 1787? I did. You know what? It's the year 2021, right? Well, yeah, but it should be 1787. Why is that exactly? Did something important happen on this day back in 1787? Yes, it did. The Constitution of the United States was signed on this day in 1787. So today is Constitution Day, a day where we celebrate this special event. You know I've heard of the Constitution before, but what makes it so special? The Constitution is an important document in our country's history. It defines the structure of our government and guarantees Americans their essential rights. That sounds important, I guess, but it's also a little confusing. I wish there was a way to make this easier for everyone to understand. What if I knew someone who could read us a book that would help explain a little bit more about it? That would be great, but do you actually know someone who could do that? I do. Mr. Chuck, would you please join us? Good morning, Emerson Eagles. Today I would like to read we, the kids. We, the people of the United States, in order to form a more perfect union, Establish justice, ensure domestic tranquility, provide for the common defense, promote the general welfare. and secure the blessings of liberty. To ourselves and our posterity, to ordain and establish this Constitution. For the United States of America. We, the people. Thank you, Emerson Eagles. Thank you, Mr. Chuck. That was a great book to help us understand a little bit more about Constitution Day. I'm excited about Constitution Day, and I feel like celebrating, but we don't have any birthdays today. I thought for sure someone, wait, do we already do? Um, would have been born on September 17th, 1787. I'm sure there were people born on that day, but none of them go to Emerson. I guess that makes sense. Do we have an eagle, any eagle feather charts to celebrate today? Yes, we do. Mrs. Stundall's class has filled their chart. Way to go. That brings us to the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You know what I was thinking? The Constitution defines how our government is set up. While our expectations are being safe, respectful, and responsible, kind of define how our school is set up. They kind of do. And Friday seems like a great day to be safe, respectful, and responsible. We'll try our best, and you should too, everyone. So, let's take flight.